So guys, today's video is the first impression and unboxing of Burberry Touch for men. You said we don't even make love no more. I'm not sure. But you know that's not right. Like I said, today's video is the first impression and unboxing of Burberry Touch for men. This is the box right here. Nice plaid look. Um, it's January currently. I got this as a, as a gift from a lovely person back in August. I got this back in August as a gift from someone. And it's just been sitting there in my room. I felt bad. I felt bad. I felt terrible the fact that it was sitting there in my room. I got it for a gift. And I wasn't putting it to use. So you know what? I'm gonna put it to use now. I'm gonna box it. This is the box right here. Remember, he touch for men. As you can see, you see all that. What is that? This is a 60 or it's 50 milliliter, 1.6 fluid ounces that opens like that you can see it right there see it has the wood top slides out <laughs> very oblong shape um, very nice, very touch for men, very nice, a light blue, almost clear, very, very light blue, almost clear, has a wooden cap, you can hear that, has a wooden cap, very nice. One point six fluid ounce bottle. The top notes for Burberry Touch for men is a fresh, spicy, ozonic, musky, aquatic, aromatic, woody, powdery, green, warm, spicy, and vanilla. Those are all the top notes before I spray it and I smell it. We're gonna smell some coffee grounds. Just to refresh and restart my my nostril palette, if you will. I'm gonna open that. Look at that. Nice tight fit, slides right off. But fits in the hand, it's not too big. Looks like a cut cone shape. Very nice scent. Immediately, you can definitely smell the spiciness in it. It's definitely, it's definitely up there. You can smell the spiciness in there. You can definitely smell a light powderiness, some musk. Um, this is very nice. This is a very nice fragrance. Oh man, I feel kind of bad now because I've had this for a while. I actually need this. I have a lot of sweet, citrusy, fresh scents. I think I'll compare this to. Maybe not the EDP, but I'll compare it to the EDT. I'll compare it to EDT. It's a little less musky, muskier. Uh, the EDP, the EDP is very musky, very spicy. I would say it's light spice, but I would say it's more musky, muskier than spicy. Um, on for a granted cup, the sillage is longevity is it's very close but the longevity is they said it's long lasting if you're looking for a scent that is not too spicy not too sweet but has a very light musk and citrus scent to it this is definitely very light citrus woody scent 
very earthy scent. Not too earthy, but it's that earthy scent. Uh, it's very nice. Uh, it's on the cheaper side too. I think this is this is between. Uh, I'm not sure exactly, but it's between thirty dollars and it's sixty. It's a very nice scent. Definitely you could ask this as a gift for Christmas birthday it's a very nice scent it won't hurt anybody's pockets overall not speaking on the longevity and massage but the presentation of the scent i'll rate this a 7 maybe 7.5 just off the presentation in the initial scent the sweetness does dry out for the most part you definitely get a woody musky scent when it dries out 7 out of 10 would recommend very nice once again this is Beret Touch for Men. Uh, seal that bad boy up. Seal that bad boy up. Once again, guys, this is the Beret Touch unboxing. Plus, first impressions. Is this a good cop or not? I would say it is uh, for the price 30 to 30 to 60 dollars a nice set like that very versatile nice big for your buck well guys that's that's it that's the end of the video and thank you very much um please like comment subscribe if you found this useful in any shape fashion or form please share this with your family members if you think they need a fragrance i think this is a very nice fragrance that would fit a lot of people until next time thank you you said we don't even make love no more i'm not sure you know that's not right